Hello everybody, I am Toast and welcome to Toast Today. We are having a look at Quilt and Cats of Calico today, which is a board game. I love board games. If you didn't know, I have a large collection behind me, which you can never see, but there, there are some on this Calyx shelf. Um, and I've never played Calico. I think the board game is just called Calico, but this is the digital version of it, Quilt and Cats of Calico. I've done a tutorial, so I maybe know how to play it. That's that's risky saying that I think, but let's give it a go. Here we go. Here is the cat of Calico. There is also a cat editor in this game, which you can create your own cat. You can name your cat. You can make its tail real floofy and and its entire being real floofy. <laughs> oh, okay. You can do a lot of stuff to this poor little cat. <laughs> oh, you can have, make its ears all floppy. Oh. Oh. Okay, pointy. And I think you can change its, yeah, you can change all its pattern. <gasps> you can give it a little mustache. A little, oh, what does this remind me of? What is that? I can't think. Sailor Moon, does she have a cat with um, a little moon on her head? Oh, a little raccoon cat. That's very cute. And you can also give them hats. <gasps> oh my God, a little froggy beanie. Oh no, your ears are too floppy. They're coming out. Oh, these are amazing. A little, oh my God, that is a big jumper. <gasps> You can make it sushi, a jetpack. Oh my God, you can make it a, like a griffin, I suppose. Okay, anyway, we're not here for doing that. I just wanted to show it off. <laughs> I just wanted to show it was an option. We're here for the story mode. Um, it's unusual for a little puzzle game to have a story mode sometimes. So I'm excited to see what this has. Uh, obviously you can play online with friends uh, or, or random people or AI, but I thought I'd check out the story mode. Um, eight spools of thread and a swordsman of needles and buttons, one thimble and a whole stack of colorful patches. That's a decent first set for somebody like you. Before your father disappeared, he taught you the basics of sewing and quilting in the kingdom of Scratchington. That was a pretty nice survival set. It is in this kingdom that the most magical cats have gathered. Bring good luck and prosperity if they're in the mood. Wow, Scratchington sounds like an amazing place to live. Though for some time now, luck has been eluding your family. It's been five years since you last saw your father. He sent it to the free city of Tonkti to help the kingdom in the face of the looming war with their neighbors. This cat kingdom is at war. Since the beginning of the war, you have no news from your father. After many months of sadness, you come to terms with the idea that he's not coming back. The cart is ready. You pocket the invitation letter from your aunt. It's time you ventured forth to the free city of Tonkati to start your sewing career in the city of cat worshippers. Wow. Oh my god, okay. I guess this is the little board. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, this is this is us in our van. Oh, our caravan. Is it? Why are we going over there? Isn't this, isn't this the mission? Oh, okay. Does it follow me? Oh, it follows me. Oh, it pushes up the rug as well. <laughs> so cute. Is this our aunt, this old lady? Aunt Agatha, you're finally here. Welcome to Comcity City today. Nope, <laughs> can't do that voice. You come at the right time. The Feline Festival is upon us and quilts for our lovely cats will be very much needed. People from all over the Kingdom of Scratchton are coming to Tonkity to celebrate and ask the cats for good fortune. Because of this, your cousin Frank got an extra cat quilt from the factory from his military allowance. The quilt was made with a new invention, <gasps> the Iron Loom. Frank saw the loom with his very own eyes. He said that it can make quilts in a matter of minutes. But so what if they are no interest to the cat? I really want a cat blessing to the festival. Please improve my quilts. The cats like it. I can do that. Okay, our objective is to get three buttons. There is a cat on my quilt currently. Please move out of the way, cats. I... <laughs> can I press the go to sleep button? Everyone go to sleep. You're in the way of my quilt. <laughs> you can wake up, but stay out of the way. Hey, what did I just tell you? All right, so you get buttons by making three in a row of color. I think it's just color. I don't think uh, patterns count. So we have two dark blues, we've got two pinks coming, and we have two purples. So those are the only three we can make um, a three in a row with. So if the pink needs to go like one, two, three, the purple needs to go here, because this is the only accessible purple, which means I can't put the dark blue there. Ah, but I can put the dark blue here. Right, okay, I think, I think I figured it out. Um, it's interesting, this is, like the actual game is quite puzzly, but this is more puzzly than I was expecting. <laughs> um, I don't know if all the levels are going to be puzzles, but it's quite an interesting concept. I like it. There we go. Three buttons, right? Is that what you wanted? Three, and then we'll just ah, congratulations, congratulations. It should no, it shouldn't say that. <laughs> yeah, I wish it did though. What a wonderful quilt! Thank you. 
The festival hasn't started yet and I've already seen at least two cats near my home. That's a good sign. There's no need to waste time with the iron loom since we've got such a talented quilter here. Your father would be proud. It's a shame he can't see your progress. Could you also help my friends, Flora and Matthew? They can release your skills. You can find Flora's stand at Matthew's workshop in the market. May the cats protect you, my dear. Uh, so we've got Flora and Matthew and another guy, just some some guy. Let's go to Matthew, I suppose. Was it Matthew? <laughs> I just forgot his name in two seconds. Craftsman. His name wasn't Matthew. Today's clothes. Wait a minute. Agatha sent you? I'm Matthew, an independent craftsman of Tom Kitty. You remind me of my younger self. I once came here to achieve something. As you can see, I did it. I set up my own workshop. <gasps> Is he secretly our dad? Now I take care of crafts and repairs. Luckily, my husband has dealt with the book bookkeeping and running the shop since he came here. I don't have a good head for that sort of stuff. But let's cut to the chase. I have a task for you. Do you see that cat tapestry? This one? The catastry? No. I like to decorate it, but I have too many jobs before the feline festival and I'd barely be able to make it in time. Help me decorate the cat tapestry, but properly. You know, I want the cats to bless my workshop with luck. Can you do it? Sure, maybe later. <laughs> I don't know if I can. Gain a rainbow button. I actually don't know how to do that. Okay, I guess the rainbow button. Hello. Excuse me, cat. Um, I have to get one of each, I think. One of each color, which means I need to make well, obviously a green, a yellow, a blue, purple, dark blue, and pink. So I've got two pinks, only one purple. Huh? How can I make a purple three-way if I've only got one purple? Oh, there's a purple there. <laughs> Silly me. So I think this is just a case of sort of figuring out where things go. It's like this one could go there. Oh, wait. Have I committed to that? Oh, shit. I have. I might regret that. But let's just try it. You know, let's let's um, try and fail. Um, we can put a pink one here. You know what? I think you can put them not in a line. This is could be a risk. You can. Okay, you can put them in a triangle as well. You've got to be next to each other. Um, let's put the blue here then. I think this is going to be fine. We've got enough room to not worry too much. Watch me fail now. The yellow can squeeze in here. Oh, we need to pick up a, a new one. And green can go along there and blue can go along there. Yes, we've, we've done this with ease. Okay, now I know what I'm doing. <laughs> sort of. Does that get me a rainbow one? That's the question. It does, okay, right. <laughs> Imagine if it didn't, all of that. And that's, whoa, okay. Oh, it's disappeared. Oh, it's just see through now. There we go. Are you happy with me, Matthew? I made you a nice rainbow quilt. What wonderful embellishments. Thank you for the help. I can use a tapestry to present my religious cat souvenirs. You have a bright future ahead of you. With that kind of talent, I'm sure you'll make some heads turn in the city. Let me tell you something. When I was young, like you, the factory wanted to draft me in. I was supposed to work on their inventions. They offered me a lot, but I couldn't be bored. I'd probably be working on some type of weapon now. <laughs> I have my workshop. I, this, the, the lore of this world is wild. Um, I work the way I want and I work for myself. I recommend that path to you too. Thanks, Matthew. Thanks for a nice bit of life advice. I guess we'll talk to... I forgot your name. I'm so sorry, lady. <laughs> lady. Oh, you're here as well. Fresh vegetables, fruit, cheaply sold. Ah, it's not my day. Hello, do you want to buy something? I suggest doing it now before I run out of things to sell. The soldiers have taken over the territory on the outskirts of Tom Kitty and many deliveries have been put on hold. Plenty of merchants have issues with the availability of merchandise. Oh, the... The war's close. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's a sewing bag. You're the one Agatha told me about. I'm Flora. I'm glad you're here. I have a task for you. Please repair the holes in the cloth I used to lay the fruits out. I want them to look nice on the stand. As I say, it pays to advertise. I'll do it. Oh, look at that fat pigeon. Um, just three buttons again. Okay. So, blues need... This is a, a tight one. Um, three differently coloured buttons. So, blues need to go here. There's nothing else that can go there. So, blue... Let's go there. Oh, watch this be wrong. Purples make sense. Purples must go... Ah, oh, there are no purples. Yellow. Yellow must go here. So I need to get through enough to get a yellow. And... Oh, ooh, this is tricky. Uh, there's not enough blues coming up, so I need to put green here. Which means blue has to go there. Green has to go there and there this one required a little bit of thinking i was gonna go too headstrong into it oh i messed up what was i doing yellow right 
<laughs> I was just talking about how I messed up. All right, there we go. Perfect. Nice. Yeah, I almost put, <laughs> I almost put the purple down, thinking, oh yeah, purple's great. No, <laughs> purple's not great. Great job. I don't know how you did it, but the cloth looks better than when I bought it. Ah, I can see those curious eyes. Don't you be shy. Come over here. Who are you talking to? Me or like a cat? Thanks for the help. Agatha wasn't lying. You've got a real gift. I don't have much, but please take this apple. Oh, I received an apple. We need to help each other out. The world isn't kind to us. Luckily, the feline festival is happening soon. Maybe with the cat's help, the war can be ended. What? What? What war? How? How are the cats going to help? Let's go talk to this fella. Hello, Wanderer. Hi, are you here for the Feline Festival too? Just asking. You don't look like the locals. Oh, you're a quilter. Great. I came to Tom Kitty to become the best circus acrobat in the world. Or at least an acrobat. I graduated recently and I've yet to find a job, but I'm pretty good already. By the way, my name's Billy. You'll hear that name again once I'm famous and rich. Rich enough to always have a full belly. Billy with a full belly. I spent all my money to get here and I didn't have enough food uh, for food, but I believe it will be worth it if I get the cat's blessing. Ah. I have an apple. Yeah, 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 I've got an apple. Take my apple. Find something to bite, thanks. Um, <laughs> you're not from around here either, but you've probably heard the rumors about the local factory, haven't you? Odd place, always closed. There's not a thing that they aren't manufacturing. They have an iron loom or some kind of scrap metal. Ah, what is, uh, they, they mass produce quilts and give them away in Tomkitty. Sounds nice, but the cats don't care for them. But the cats are gonna help us win the war. We've gotta to appeal to the senses. Let's talk to Auntie Agatha, see what she's going to say about this. You're finally here! Matthew and Flora told me that you helped them. Thank you, my dear. You bay into the walls of Tom Kitty, and you're already taken... No, you're already the talk of the place. <laughs> this these small acts of kindness hold great power, never forget that. Mind you, before you return, a messenger from the factory came to my house. Apparently someone from the engineering chair wants to see me. Oh no, I'm getting recruited. I've never been recruited before. This is, this is quite exciting, actually. Even if I don't want a job. <laughs> it's, it's fun nonetheless. Hello, engineer. Why does no one have a name? It just shows their title. <laughs> I'm glad you got the message. I'm Mona. Oh, there we go. Now she has Now she has a name. News achievements has recently reached the factory's main hall. Supposedly you're sewing extremely beautiful quilts. Well, it's been said. I doubt the best not... Oh, no. I even made a bet with my sister about that. She thinks it's not ready. Nonsense. The only thing left for me is to, uh, is to test it. Ha! I have a feeling I'm going to win that bet with Tina today. In the name of the Iron Loom, I challenge you to a quilting duel. Come with me to the factory and face our best invention. Okay. <laughs> okay. The lamp lights and the vestibule switch on with a loud crackle as you pass the factory's gate. <gasps> oh my god, my mortal enemy. You can see the giant metal machine before you, full of bolts and valves. <gasps> this must be the famous iron loom. You're intimidated by the massive heavy body of the loom and the measured grumbling of the engines that makes one quilt after another at tremendous speed. I am. It's true, I'm nervous. Oh, we got a whole room here. We gotta do everything. Hello. Here we are. What's up the stair? Impressive place, isn't it? And that's just the vestibule. The main hall is even bigger. And there are even more machines there. But only a few have access to it. Meet our star, the Iron Loom. Recent Why does the Iron Loom sound so intimidating? Like the Iron Cursing or something, isn't it? Recently put it in the vestibule for a presentation for the military. They also got a couple of quilts to test. Do you see how fast it is? It's due to our head engineer. I'm telling you, the guy's a genius. But enough of this. Ready for a do 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 uh, Let's begin. <laughs> is this going to be like the full game or is this objective? Just finish the game, not win? Not win? So I can see what the iron loom's up to and I can see what I'm up to. This is actually a full game. It's got the uh, things. Um, I was going to go over there and check that out, but it looks like we're getting it in the campaign. Right, cats, leave me alone for a moment. So firstly, you have to pick your... Pick your poisons, I suppose. Pick, pick, <laughs> pick your objectives. What is this, equals? 10 for all different colors or all different patterns. That's hard. So basically, it's these are saying you either need like A, A, B, B, C, D. So you need two of one color, two of another color, and then one of two more colors. Um, and if you get either color or style, you get five points. If you get color and style fitting those criteria, you get seven points. So the higher, the higher they are to make, the higher the points they are. I'm sure if I looked through this really, really cleverly, <laughs> if I was a card counter, I'll be like, okay, I'll be able to make this one, I'll be able to make that one. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not a card counter. So we're gonna do this one. We're gonna do, will I regret that? 
I'll have to if if none of them are gonna be equal. If I put that there, I think I'd fail. But if I put it there, I think it's okay. And let's get the A A A B B C D. Yeah, yeah, sure. So you get three. You get one that you don't choose. I'm nervous. I'm nervous already. I'm I'm facing off against machinery. This is man versus machine. Um, so let's let's start simple. Let's start with this. So we're also still trying to get three in a, you know three in a row. Get our get our buttons. Get our other stuff. Um, so I need to be thinking about that as well. <laughs> That's a lot to think about in this game. Um, I don't know how the tabletop version works because there's so much to do um, and so much to keep track of that I just I think I'd be overwhelmed. So if we pick this blue one then that helps us because that means we've got two blues and two crosses which means this one is done uh, well no sorry BB is done currently um, <laughs> I'm really scared. How's the Iron Loom? The Iron Loom's got three already? Oh, oh, the Iron Loom just started by making a three in a row. That, that's that's fine. I don't need to worry about threes in a row. So maybe I do. Maybe I should worry about threes in a row. So if I put this green one here, then I get a a a for pattern. All here. And then I get a unique colour. I could put it here though, because then that's AA done for pattern. Is, is what I'm saying clear? <laughs> I'm just I think I'm speaking a bit of bit of rubbish, aren't I honestly? Um let's get this one. Cause there's a lot of there's another one. Okay. This could be this could be interesting. Oh no, I can't put oh sugar. Right, let's put the purple there. Now if I take this one, right, this is where I'm gonna mess up. So if I put it there, oh, I can't right now, but if, for instance, next time I put it there, then I get AAA in pattern, BB in color. And I can't put it there because it has the same pattern as that one. Oh God, <laughs> sure. Is anyone following this? Have you played this game? Um, I've heard it's a great board game, but I think it will be too much for me. <laughs> uh, I don't know how I'd be able to keep track of all these points. That's right. If I put this here now, or here, if I put this here, then that's A A A A A A A B B. Boo boo. And I had to put a, this, I've done it, I've done it. I need to put a C down, which is nothing else. So I could put this yellow one right there and bam, that's done. I think, hopefully. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm gonna take this purple one. I'm not gonna put the yellow one there. I'm gonna put the purple one there because I need a yellow one for here. And that yellow one is currently doubly unique. Right, let's worry about this. Okay, I didn't get it. That's it. Done, is it? A, A, B, C. <gasps> we got the double. We did it. Oh my god. Okay, I'm impressed. How are you doing, Iron Loom? Alright. Yeah, you're doing okay. Okay. Alright, fine. I wish I hadn't looked. Um, so this is still not got really anything apart from AAs and patterns. So I need another blue, so let's take that. So I need to put this yellow Anywhere here, it actually doesn't matter. I'll put it here, just, I'm not gonna be able to make that a three, unfortunately, but I'll put it there for now. Um, I would like none of these colors. <laughs> I'll take the light blue. Do I want that? No, okay. So, A, 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 ah, okay, I'll put that there. Cause then I've got A, A, I know dot. Oh, hello. Thank you. I could get. Oh, I could have put that yellow one here. And I could make it a three. Let's put you there. So I've got two dots now. And I've got. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What I've got. <laughs> I've got a C and a D. <laughs> 
I might be in this little loom still. I am, but he hasn't made any of his uh, things yet. He's just been doing threes in a row. I've personified the loom. I'm calling them a he. <laughs> this is this is how the uprising started. Um, right there we go. We got another three in a row. That's some that's some little bonus points. Now, now let's think about this toast. What are we doing? I could get you. You are a, a wild card. Yes. Yes. Yes, and then I ideally need that yellow. I can hold off to that yellow. What yellow is that? I don't know. I can't actually see it. It's, it's like a flat. I think it's this flowery one, which is fine. So if I put you here, um, I'll take a yellow. No, wait, I'll take a green. <laughs> I'll make my mind up one moment. I'll take a green you. Thank you. And now I really need this yellow. Will it come out on my turn? Oh, no, there it is. <gasps> there it is. I need that, I think. Okay. Green. Go there, right? Go there. Yes. Help. <laughs> What's the missing color that we don't have here? And the missing pattern? It's that pattern in light blue, which I. I don't think it's in the deck. <laughs> <laughs> deck? <laughs> a deck of patchwork quilts? Okay, we'll take this. Um, and that means this will, I think, complete both of these. This is the moment of truth, I suppose. Let's just double check. There's two of them, two of them, one, one. Yeah, I think this is it. Let's see. A, B, C, D. Colours. Check. A, B, C, D. Patterns. Check. Nice. They really jump you into this game. They they just make you do three in a row for the last, first few levels. And then suddenly you have to quilt a whole thing. Where is that blue that I need? That blue doesn't exist. Oh, that's real bad. The blue I need is there. I don't think we're gonna get that far in this game, but let's see. <laughs> um, do I need anything? A pink maybe? one. So you can't add on to existing three in a rows to make another three in a row. So I actually can't do anything with this one. I could put a green here to get a green, and I could put a pink here and here to get a pink. Yeah. So I'll take a pink. Because every little point helps currently. Imagine if he takes that blue that I need. I'll be, I'll be livid. So that blue goes here first. Bung. Oh, we're gonna get a rainbow. <gasps> we're gonna get a rainbow. <laughs> That's so exciting. Purple. Where's that blue? <laughs> uh, and the green, look. That's the last color we need to, to form a rainbow. How many bonus points is that? Another three or is it, is it just, yeah, it's a bonus three, okay. That's cool. So I need pinks, oh. There are none. <laughs> I don't think we're reaching far enough into the pack to get the one that I need. Oh, yeah, no way. Oh, okay, I need to get a blue at least. Cause then at least I get the color. I'm not gonna get I'm not gonna get patterns. Oh I could get I could just put hit this here and get the patterns as well actually. Okay, that's fine. What's the difference between 10 and 15 points? <laughs> like five? <laughs> that doesn't really matter, does it? Well, my the iron loom is pretty impressive apparently. Um, let's just do it. I wonder if you can plan ahead in this. <laughs> Maybe it's just bad luck, but this information was public. I did know it was not going to happen if I had read it. B, C, D, E. <laughs> Damn it. How about patterns though? Why B? C, D, E, F. Oh yeah, 10 coins. That's all right, 10's fine. And then let's, it makes no difference what we put up here. So let's take you, end the turn, check how the loom's doing. Awful, oh my God, this loom is awful. He didn't get any of his bonuses. He's not gonna get this one. Oh, he might get, no, he's not gonna get the pattern one. The loom sucks. Why are they bragging about this loom? I'm amazing. I'm way better than an iron loom. 
All he's good at doing is three in a row. <laughs> Sorry, not to call you out, Loom, but he didn't even do that as good as I did. <laughs> there we go. I'm a master quilter, and his trophy has scary eyes on it. Blast it, I lost the bet. I didn't think you could beat the Iron Loom. The rumors about you were true. You really do have the knack for quilting. It's <laughs> it seems to have to work on the Iron Loom's code. It should be as good as, if not even better than, the most skilled quilter. Thanks for participating. Oh, I got an achievement. Win, win, win a fight against the Iron Loom. <laughs> Quilt against the machine. Um, I've come to a few conclusions about some possible improvements. I need to speak to the head engineer. Can you find a way by yourself? The carriage awaits you by your gate. It'll take you to your aunt. What? Oh, right. Did I come in her carriage? I guess so. <laughs> it's just a magic carriage that would take me to my aunt. I love this little veg veg patch over here. I want to go there. Hey, aunt. I, I destroyed a machine. You're here at last, my dear. You've gone for this long... Why is she always... She's constantly worried about how long I'm outside. I wasn't gone for that long, I don't think. Hope thing, everything's all right. These people from the factory, I don't trust them. They only think of their inventions. Nothing else matters to them. Maybe if it weren't for them, maybe if it weren't for their unyielding desire to win, we wouldn't have a war now. You've been in Tom Kitty for a while now. I've been here for tw 20 minutes, less than 20 minutes. And you and Frank haven't seen each other yet. We have to fix it while we can. Frank, is, who's Frank? <laughs> He's getting ready to go to the front line. If you're so close to your kids, I'm sure that Frank will be happy if it's him. I'm not going to the front line of the bloody war. I get to the military camp on the outskirts of the city. You have to go through the main gate. I'm sure you can find it. What is going on in this world? I can just go up here to the front lines of war. All right. The main gate to Tom Kitty closes behind you with a loud bang. You're back in the countryside in tiny Whiskerville. Oh, it was here with the support of your father that you managed to take the first steps in sewing and quilting. The sing of birds mixes with the bustle of the recently established military camp. <laughs> it's time to meet your cousin. Ah, cousin Frank, of course. <laughs> I got an achievement. Complete the first act. We did it, we completed the first act. Is this cousin Frank? Cousin Frank! Oh. You can see the strapping figure of the general through the tent's entrance. This is not Frank. He stands focused over the maps. Maybe he's thinking of a strategy. Better not disturb him. Oh, right. Sorry. Sorry, not Frank. Maybe your cousin Frank. Frank! Who do we have here? Long time no see! I'm glad you're here! Mother was right, you haven't changed a bit since we last saw you. It's good she let me know you're in the city. As you can see, I became a soldier. And I became a quilter. I want to help the war. Our country deserves peace. And um, our army has quite handsome uniforms. <laughs> a fashionable Frank. Your aunt has probably told you that I'm going to the front line soon. She gave me a lucky cat quilt. It's supposed to grant me a safe return. Can you sew some buttons on my quilt? And I'll be able to fasten it to my uniform. Yes, I can definitely do that. I just defeated the Iron Loom. You think, like, what is that? <laughs> what is that? Gain one of the cat token. Ah, I forgot about this. There's another thing, isn't there? There's an, another thing to, to, to worry about. So each of the cats, Callie here, which is she's just waking up, she wants three in a pattern like this, a little uh, honeycomb styly thing. She wants either flowers or ferns in that pattern. So I need to make three in a row colours. Wait, is this it? I've only got two things to make it with? Oh. What? Is there another one? Okay, I can put... Oh, this is... I'm going to fail this one the first time. Let's try and put it here. So this pattern you can also make at an angle. So if I put a yellow one there, it'll still count. No, wait, not a yellow one. Uh, a flowery one. So I think I can get the badge... Why can't I put that there? What am I doing? Why can't I put that there? <laughs> Why wouldn't it let me do that? Oh no. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm confused. Is it saying that's so wrong that I can't do it? Oh. Oh, you know what it is saying? It's saying that I, I've already messed it up. <laughs> it's giving me a hint. It's saying you only have two blues left. So, so to make the three, three in a rows, you can't put it there, my friend. Oh, beans. I've messed it up then. Are there any more flowers? There's one there. But that doesn't help. How the hell can I do this? Flower, flower. Let's just lose. There's nothing I can do about this loss, unfortunately. 
<laughs> I just try to attach a blue to a to a green, so that's the sort of how things are going right now. There we go. Look, perfect, done. <laughs> Failure. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try that again. Um, get out of the way, kiddies. Um, right. So I need these two. Yeah, I think if I put this blue one here, and then I can put this yellow one here, because I've got an extra yellow. I think I think that's it. I think it's the only change I have to make. The fact that yellow was in my starting hand, I thought, nah, let's just... Oh, I put it in the wrong place. I need to undo. Oh, I can? Oh, God, you can undo in this mode. Okay, great. But it's still when I put a yellow there. Okay, I, I think maybe I'm looking at something wrong. But I have enough yellows to make a three in a row regardless. It shouldn't... Shouldn't force my hand like that. Um, maybe it would if I lead a yellow up there. If I do this and then oh, take this green and then put a yellow there. Okay, there we go. So that's there we go. We got a little kitty. We got Callie's symbol on us, and there we go. There's a green one. Nice. We did it. These are really fun puzzles. I like I like this way of doing it. I like the base game like the actual calico game, but I really like the, the puzzles as well. Great job, thanks. Mother told me you take after Uncle. Uncle? <laughs> Uncle, she was right. I was hoping I could find something out about your father in the army. Unfortunately, nobody knows anything. Or oh, they're keeping it quiet. Maybe somebody from the factory knows something. Your father worked with them. Since the beginning of the war, they've been supplying the army with weapons as well as our beautiful uniforms. He is on about these uniforms, isn't he? They use the iron loom to that end. I saw it with my own eyes. I know. And I beat it. I punched it. Without the help, we'd have a big problem with the supplies, and the enemies would have already marched into Tom Kitty a long time ago. Since you're in camp, maybe you could help Edward and Gustav. They should be around here. We've got a lot of choices. One of them's Edward, one of them's Gustav, one of them's this this person. Is this the same person we met earlier? Is it the, the, the hungry guy? Billy? Billy in his belly? No, it's not Billy. <laughs> Remember me? It's me, Greta! No! I'm grazing my sheep in the pasture over there, but I thought I saw a familiar face. I haven't seen you in ages. Is that your final return from Tom Kitty? It's pretty bustling, isn't it? I can't stand it. Here in tiny Whiskerville, it's a lot calmer. Well, that camp excluded. Recently, the army has taken over a large part of the pasture and some of the local houses. There's a great commotion among the soldiers. Soldiers? <laughs> They've been leaving for the front line soon. I hope they'll be back safe and sound. You know what? When I'm worried, I start fiddling with the scarf you made. So I made her a scarf? That? I made that red scarf? That's rubbish. I'm way better than that now. I can definitely patch it up for you. I can make patches galore. Two cat tokens and four buttons. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Right. Two... I need five plus... Is that just anywhere? I actually don't know how this works. Five plus in a row? Okay, there, there is only this pattern, so I just need to make everything in a row. So it's all about placement of the colours. I've got two yellows, two purples, two greens, two blues. So I need to do something. <laughs> I don't know what I need to do. Um, let's just wing it, right? There's only one purple, which I think actually was a major clue as to where I need to place things. <laughs> why, won't he, why can't I go there? <laughs> oh, there's two purples. What is going on? Why would it let me put things where I want to put them? Hmm. I don't know if I'm missing some hand holding, but whatever it is, I'm not enjoying the hand holding. I don't need my hands held. This might actually work. Look, if I put this yellow here, oh. if I put this purple, if I put this green, where can I put this green? Why can I put it? So I can put it there. Why can't I put this purple here? I can put it here. I think it is holding my hands, but I'm just not realizing it. Because apparently I can only put the purple here. Odd. But why does that matter? Is this something about these symbols that I just don't understand? Are, is, are these lines meaning something? I don't know. Maybe I didn't listen to that part of the tutorial. <laughs> um. Right, if we put this yellow here, that should get us a cat and a badge. <gasps> Yippee, we got a coconut. Wait, which one's coconut? Your coconut. Get up, coconut. Right, so now the next part's going to be a bit harder. 
And I think I failed it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I failed it. <laughs> this is only going to be a four. So the colours I've done... Oh wait, what? Where's the fifth? Oh, this yellow one in the corner! That's tiny! That's a that's a bloomin' pattern! I didn't see that there. Thank you, Coconut, for being more reserved than I am. Good, good girl, boy or cat. Thank you so much. Congratulations! Hey, hey. As good as new, thank you! It reminds me of better times ahead. Wait, I didn't read that. <laughs> she didn't say ahead. Uh, and of you, thank you, Greta. Mm. Please take the sheep milk cheese. And this is Stardew Valley, <laughs> what's going on here? Wait, you can't milk your sheep in Stardew Valley, can you? Veteran, is this uh, Gustav? Ugh, what did we do to my tapestry? This is completely useless. He must have been in a world of his own again. Hey you, I saw you walk around the camp. You're Frank's relative, aren't you? Gustav, Colonel of the Intelligence, decorated for services to the kingdom. Is at your service? Well, I'm retired, but I often advise General Joseph. Sure, you're still a kid, but I've heard things about you. So I have a mission for you. Recently, I gave that good for nothing Edward my tapestry for alterations. However, he let his imagination run wild again, and he made it. Oh, oh, it's no use wasting my breath. Fix my tapestry, or at least make it look like it did before Edward's interference. What did Edward do to this thing? <laughs> the next screen comes up, and it's just covered in feces. Oh, God, Edward! <laughs> what did you do? Um, so this is just seven dots. So I just have to build one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay, this is a really easy one. Gustav, you could have done this. Why wouldn't it let me put a blue? I'm so confused about the placement in this game and why it won't let me put things in places sometimes. Look, why will it, where will it let me put this? Next to the dark blue, and that's it. And there. I don't want to put it there. Huh? I'm, I'm, I'm really confused about that. Pink can't go. How can I complete this puzzle if it won't let me put things where I need to put them? I need to get seven in a row. The only way of doing that is to go this way, right? Because that won't be seven. That'll be one, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. Maybe I have done something wrong. I don't know. Right, let's try that again. I'm, I'm confused about this this whole... I, I bet it's like in checkers where, you know, you have to take a piece if you can take a piece. That always confused me. <laughs> I don't think it's the most, most complex rule, but it always confused me regardless. <laughs> this sort of works, right? Yeah, actually, I think I, this might be the way to do it. Um, I put a pink there. And a blue there. There. Oh, there we go. Okay. I guess you have to put them next to a colour in this in this mode. You have to put them next to your own colour. Well, we did it. The puzzle was solved. But I wish it told me. I wish it said you can only put it next to colours of its own. Because you can't... In the main game, you can put it wherever you want, I think. I wasn't wrong about you. Your skills are impressive. By the way, I saw you peeking into the commander's tent. Why are you blushing? I vetted you. I know you're alright. <laughs> Although I, you do look inconspicuous. Like a spy. I wonder what I look like. I thought I was a giant cat. I'll tell you a secret. As a wolf, you'll work, but try to keep it to yourself. We think there are fewer and fewer cats on the streets. I have a theory the enemy is stealing them for their own purposes. <gasps> I have no evidence yet, but I'm working on it. Keep your eyes open. Times are tough. We're lucky we have the factory. It supplies us really well. We have a chance to win. Well, I'm here now, Gustav, and I'm the real winner. Wow, Taylor, I like your scarf. Hmm, where's that thread? Oh, there it is. Though I'm not sure what the colour. Oh, excuse me, you have quite a big collection of sewing supplies on you, so Frank must have sent you. I'm Edward. I do sewing jobs for the army. Usually, you know, embroider sleeves with cat figures for the guys. You know, for luck. Recently, the factory has taken over the manufacturing of the uniforms. However, I have a feeling there's something wrong with them. My cat patches don't work quite as well with them. I've been thinking about it for a couple of days, and it's given me a spitting headache. We need to add some personalities to these uniforms, but how? I can definitely make alterations. By which I mean I can add a few haphazard patches. Right, okay. He's into dots. I think, ooh, and, and it's in this like five formation. Can that can't fit in there, right? No, it could fit in one. How would it fit in there? What am I looking at here? One, two, three, four. If I put them all here, but is it following the same rules again of I can only place it next to its own blue and color? Let's see. 
No, okay, now, now it's fine. So that was just a case of finding the right place for it. That was easy, Edward. There you go. There's your, there's your damn quilt, uh, scarf, whatever it was. Mm -mm -mm. Frank is quite the daddy. He'll go and say when he sees a design. That's why I like my handmade garments. They're panache and soul. I used to work at the factory, you know. I constructed the iron loom with the head engineer. Yeah, well, it's rubbish, Edward. The one that makes uniforms for the army now. But one day there was an accident. I left. <gasps> After the accident, I wanted to do something for my heart. My friend Joseph, the general, I mean, found me a job as a tailor here. Hmm, by the way, lately he's been looking especially distressed. <gasps> His wife, poor health? Oh no. Oh wait, I'm going back to cousin uh, Ralph? Frank, your presence as the captain did go unnoticed. You made an impression on everyone. Well, it was okay. <gasps> the general wants me. I can't cure your wife. I, I don't think Patches can do that, general. I can try. I also can't fight a war. <laughs> Oh, you're here. Very well. Let's not waste time on pleasantries. According to my subordinates, 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 you're a trained professional and you work fast. We need someone like you. Make a new stand for the army tonkity. Oh, standard. Oh my god. I thought it said stand, like in a in a fight when you make a stand. <laughs> okay, I can make a standard. I'll do it. <laughs> Jeez. Um, win the game is the objective. I'm fighting the commander and I've got to, I've got to gain one of each cat. Yeah, uh, yeah. Right. I don't want to be worrying about this one too much. So let's get these three. Although sometimes this one's hard. Um, getting four of the same thing, not fun. Mm, yeah, let's try that. Okay. So we also need to think about everything. Oh my god. Um, Tibbet likes these, so you can go here. <laughs> and let's should we just beeline for one of them. Let's just make Tibbet happy. Straight, straight, straight away. <laughs> straight away. Um, there we go. Look, two in a row. This is not going to win me the game, though. <laughs> They're going to hate this. If I can get all of these stripes, actually, as well, that would be really useful. Oh, I need that, though, as well. Oh, jeez. Mm, let's... I want that yellow. <laughs> I want everything. Um, let's... I'm going to try to go for stripes. There seems to be a lot of stripes, but I do need to get every stripe that's on offer. Will you leave this pink stripe for me? Yes. Oh, but I, I needed that too. Right. If I put this here, take this. Now, will you leave the purple stripe? <laughs> that would also be very nice. Um, stripes. Oh, I have a pattern for stripes, actually. Um, oh, well. Let's do the purple, do the purple. Oh, yes. Commander, you are making a friend today. Oh, wait, can I put this here? I don't want the purple one. Do I? Do I want the purple one? No, I can't use the purple one. If I put the pink one here, I've got to commit to the pink. Oh, this is where it's tricky. You know, getting four of the same thing. So I will need to get either a green or a pink um, stripe. And there isn't one. I can't do the pink stripe. There's one really far down. Oh dear. Um, so I'm looking for either a, a, a blue stripe. There's no blue fern though. Are there any other stripes? Purple stripe. There's a purple stripe. I don't know how far down this list we get. That's the, that's the problem really. There's a yellow fern. No yellow stripes. Why is this so hard? I feel like I'm making decisions way sooner than I need to really think about them. Let's just hope. What else can we do but hope? Um, mm. <laughs> Let's put the pink one. Oh, do I want to commit to pink? Because I know for a fact I can't do it anytime soon. Sure, let's do it. Oh god. Um, I haven't thought about this one. I need three in a row. I can do that. I can get... Um, if I put you here and take this green one, then I can get a third. There. No, wait. I didn't want to do that. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Because now I can't get three in a row in the pink. Damn it. Ah, well. <laughs> it's no big deal. Um, I need that. Oh. 
commander. Why did you do that to me? I needed it. I said, I, I called it out loud. Um, let's put you here. And I haven't got a single blue at the moment. Do I want a blue? Not really. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want a blue at all. Um, yellow dots, is that useful? I don't think I'm going to get this cat. I think the cat's going to be an issue. Um, I don't have room for the cat. And apart from here, I need to save every stripe I can get and just put them there. Um, I need you. Because then I can make you. Yes. I might actually have to do that. It was a silly idea. What am I doing with this? What am I doing with this? Oh, I'm putting it here. Do I take another one? Do I take another one? <laughs> oh, it's four in a row? Oh, sugar. I thought it was three in a row. <laughs> Okay, I can take it, and then I put, I put, so, oh no, so this will be the three, the three A's for pattern will be leaf, um, and then I need either one more purple or one more yellow, that's fine, and then I need one more stripe, oh look, I can get the one more yellow, one more purple here. And then the last one could be anything. Oh, but I can't put that there. I could put it here. Couldn't I? Help. Somebody help me. Can I? Do I want to save it? I want to put my stripes down here, don't I, to get... What did I want? Oh, flip. Oh, beans. I've beansed it. This is, this is beans. I don't think I can get Cali. Put the little cat that's behind my face cam, probably. Um, the only way I can get it is by putting... I can, I can mess up. I can win, but mess up here, I guess. Because I need to put a stripe there, but then that means I need a pink or green stripe. I'm going to mess up a lot. <laughs> I'm, I'm committing to messing up a lot. Is that the only place I can get it? I think it is. There's a stripe here. That doesn't help. There's a stripe. That doesn't help. Are there any dots? I can't see any dots. I don't think I've put a single dot down. There's no dots on this one. There's one dot there. Okay, let's mess up. What's my plan? Put it there, right? I can't put it there. It won't even let me. Wait, I want to mess up. Oh, wait. It's not my turn. <laughs> Sorry, Commander. I was really making you wait for that. Yeah, that is the only option, yeah. I'm just, oh wait, there's a dot here. <gasps> I'm saved. Now I've just got really bad cards. But I am saved, I can put two dots here if I ever get two dots. You know what? I'm committing to it. Now where do I put these stripes that I've acquired? <laughs> I guess put, I'll put the blue here. I don't want any of this, any of this junk. <laughs> I'll take you. Um. Yeah. 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 Sure. So if I put you here, then that gets me Millie. That may have affected something else. I've got AA, AA. And these are just random. Okay, okay. That's fine. I'm doing, I'm doing okay. I'm not doing very okay. This is AAA. <laughs> There's too much to keep track of in this game. Who made this game? Um, I don't know actually. <laughs> but whoever it was. Oh no, the commander's winning. I think that should be a, oh no. Oh no, it's not, of course. Oh. I needed a yellow or a purple. It would have been fine if I put that purple one there. Oh yeah, well we got we got that at least. Um, a <laughs> let's a dot. Yeah, we got a dot. Right, our first dot. We're almost. 
Oh wait, we haven't got... Oh no, wait. Have we got all of them? No, we've, oh, we've got two Millies, that's why I'm confused, okay. We need a Cali. That's my only chance. Is that so bad? I, I really can't tell. A A A A. A A A A. Does this make sense to everyone? I, I sure hope it is. Uh, <laughs> let's put a dot here. There we go, now I'm in the lead again. And I'm gonna... Uh, okay, now I'm actually a little bit screwed. Because I can't... Oh, we're not gonna get to the next dot either, are we? Okay, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to mess up this one. This one's not getting done at all. Oh, but it's going to mess up this one as well. <laughs> I'm not going to beat the... I can't do both at once. I'm not going to beat the commander if I... get the cats. There's a dot there. Oh, wait, there is a dot coming up. Oh, piss. I've got the worst... the worst patches. There's a dot coming up, but there's not a green or a pink, so I'm still screwed. That one will work. Up top. You won't be the dot, will you? Okay, cool. the dot will be on their turn. Dot! Yes! Right, you go there. That should be five and seven both done. Oh! Colours good. Oh! 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 Oh my god. That was work. That was real work. Um, I need this dot to get the cat. We are slightly winning now. But the commander, I fear... Oh, he beans one. He, he completely messed that one up. Right, this should be Cali. Yes. Okay. Three cats achieved. That was one of the aims. Now he's got to win. I can currently do nothing. Oh wait, you know what? I can. I can get a seven by putting down this and this. I can get a seven, and that's fine. That's all I need, really. Yeah, take that. I don't, I don't even care. There we go. A. But then, A. B. Nice. Is the commander going to make a big comeback in his last turn? Uh, He could get, like, he might actually. No, surely not. No. <laughs> he definitely did not. <laughs> oh my god, we did it. And he gets a scary trophy again. Congratulations! So it's the standard. Let's put it outside and watch it for a while. Hmm. There's a cat. Oh, and another one. Oh, and another one. Oh, a job well done. You did a great deed for the whole Tom Kitty. With this cat's help, we can surely destroy the southern units. Oh. Please take the standard to the city. Give it to my wife, Vivian. You can find her in the upper city in a house surrounded by flowers. You received the standard. We should focus on protecting the people inside Tom Kitty. We'll win the war, but in a different way. We should grant the citizens safety. What? Tell Vivian to put the stand up on the main square of the upper city. Let it protect Tonkity. The cats would need them more. Wow, we have a lot more quests to do. But we're going to end there for today. That was Quilts and Cats of Calico. Let me know what you thought in the comments. This was going to be a one-off. Um, a, a slice, if you will. A slice of the game. Uh, just to you know, fit with the branding of the channel. Um, but if you want to see more, let me know. This actually is very puzzly. The, the, the puzzle games are puzzling. I thought it would just be like board game against different opponents but this is more more puzzly as i've said and i really like it check it out if you want i'll put a steam link in the description and check out the board game if you played the board game let me know because i think i want to check out the board game now after playing this because it's you know one of the few i haven't played anyway thank you so much for watching let me know what you thought in the comments i'd love to hear and i'll see you real soon goodbye